Hey guys, we are back. In today's topic, we are talking about Harlem. Oh my god, Harlem. I was there last night at the Cotton Club, and let me tell you something. There are so many gold diggers there, but I had the best time of my life. I'm not even going to lie. <clears throat> Some guy tried to frame me for kissing his wife. I'm like, I don't do that. That's not that's, that's not how we do it. That's not how we go. They called me the cake eater. And if y'all know what a cake eater is, it's a ladies, man. I was getting all the ladies. But that's not the point. We're here to talk about Harlem and its amazing treasures that it has, <clears throat> like its poets. Okay? Claude McKay and Langston Hughes, my two favorite poets of all time these two people they just have these words that paint a picture in your mind when they when they speak on the mic when they when they get on when they do what they do best you guys know what i'm talking about go listen to them um fletcher henderson and louis armstrong these two guys wow they are the definition of music i i have never been a big fan of jazz until I heard these guys play at the Cotton Club <clears throat> last night. These guys, man. But the Cotton Club was, it was just so energetic. Like, everybody was dancing. I can't really dance that well, you know. It's it's not, you know, just how it is, you know. But anyway, man, they had so much giggle water. If you don't know what giggle water is, it's alcohol. <laughs> And I know I'm not supposed to be saying this on the air and everything like that, but hey, what are you going to do, arrest me? You know what you guys need to do? You guys need to arrest that guy, Al Capone. This guy right here, man. Oh, my God. But listen, Al Capone, I'm sorry. I hope you didn't hear that. It was a joke. But, <clears throat> man, my jalopy ran down yesterday in the middle of the street. So, you know, I had to walk home. And I don't, I don't live that far from Harlem. I live, you know, maybe a couple miles out. And you know, it it was just, it was just amazing. I had the the greatest time in Harlem. Please check out the Cotton Club and go to the Apollo Theater. They, it, it's so beautiful inside. I love it. Harlem, shout out to, shout out to your musicians. Shout out to your poem, your poets. Poems too, all of that good stuff. Shout out to the kind people that make Harlem what it is. Because Harlem wouldn't be what it is without all the people, the kind people. They're so kind.